Jim Bob Duggar is running for state senate in Arkansas. This is a sentence that was unbelievable to write several weeks ago, back when the polarizing father of 19 first announced his candidacy. But now? After Jim Bob's son, Josh, was convicted on child sex abuse charges? And it came out in court that Jim Bob and Michelle went out of their way to cover up Josh's history of accusation when he was a young teenager? It's downright laughable that Jim Bob hasn't pulled out of the aforementioned race. And also rather depressing that he may still win. On Sunday, meanwhile, Amy Duggar jumped on social media to mock both her uncle and the fact that he really is running for office on a platform of family values. Yes. Jim Bob Duggar. And family values. I was told last night that I should run for Senate. Amy joked last night on Twitter. They told me that I was bold, and that I actually stand for family values, and that my closet doesn't hide any skeletons. Lies or deceit? Haha politics are definitely not my thing, but I can't help but wonder how that race would go. Not many lines one needs to read between here, are there? Not many bushes Amy is trying to beat around, huh? Ever since Josh got arrested in April, Amy has been more outspoken than ever about just how effed up her infamous family members tend to be. She praised Jesus after the guilty verdict came down against her cousin, and has taken every opportunity available to drag the living hell out of Jim Bob. On Saturday, for example, Amy referred to Josh's confession that he inappropriately touched numerous little girls when he was between the ages of 12 and 15. As you likely know at this point, he wasn't arrested because his parents allegedly got him into some sort of therapy, although it was never made clear what the heck this meant. Real therapy. Not just thoughts and prayers, Amy tweeted over the weekend, adding, Don't get me wrong I definitely believe in the power of prayer. But I also believe in putting in the work towards your mental health and talking to a skilled professional counselor. For his part, Jim Bob certainly did not drop out of his state senate race after his son was convicted of pedophilia last Thursday. Instead, he doubled down on the campaign. He tried to use Josh's conviction as a talking point in his favor. As a father, I am heartbroken over the entire situation regarding my son, all who have been affected by it in any way, and those who have been harmed through CSAM, Jim Bob, 56 shared on Facebook on December 11. As an American, I respect our legal system and am thankful for those who serve in it. As a Christian, I put all of my trust in Christ in both the joyful and difficult moments of life. As your state senator, I promise to remain an unwavering conservative voice representing our great community in Little Rock. Thank you for your prayers and support. So there you have it. Vote Jim Bob Duggar. We're just kidding. Please do not do that.